Hello everybody, welcome back to XCOM 2. I'm Neg Primer, and we are... Uh, we are not gonna jump right into the mission that, uh, I unlocked last time. Uh, because I didn't realize all the people that I had out sick, and so we're going to, uh... We're going to forego that for Avenger now. New Just for now. We'll come back. Uh, and the hope is that this won't cause any problems. <laughs> if it does, I have that save I can go back to, but uh, I don't really want to do that. And it depends on what kind of problems it causes as well. Domination. Continue training. Let's just keep getting him. Apparently we can just keep getting him more and more abilities. So we might as well keep going with him. So Nox just got ready. The person that we're really waiting waiting for is Ruskles. Uh, okay, that got rid of one of our proving grounds. Hello. That's the codex, Commander, of course. We're making progress piecing this thing back together. But it hasn't been pretty. Our soldiers completely disabled this unit in the field. What we're hearing is merely a byproduct of electrical impulses. I assure you, it is well past the point of feeling hate. I, how could you possibly know that? I'll take your word for it, Doctor. I wouldn't. You a new secret now. These are coordinates. Return coordinates. I think we've got a point of origin. Well, part of one. Something else. Something underneath. One more. The unit is attempting to block further access. That's not all it's doing. I'm losing the data we've already decrypted. Almost there. Just one more adjustment. <laughs> I think you're gonna blow up the ship. It's accessing the power core, overriding my safety, increasing power levels. Dragon, sever the connection. There. Some sort of fail-safe protocol, I imagine. The codex must have intentionally overloaded the interface to prevent any further theft of information. Still. I believe I was one step ahead. That's an enormous amount of data. Yes, and I expect it may take some time to decipher. Better get started. I don't think we're gonna be able to do that again. I'll proceed with the necessary research and preparation. With your approval, of course, Commander. I'd also suggest we look into those coordinates. That's if I can reconstruct the data we lost in the transfer. Just hope it was worth it. New objective added. Okay. I've updated our latest operational objectives, Commander. In the field, the Codex appears as an anomalous form oh. in an almost constant state that, of flux. Why did that kill only present my in our world for milliseconds at a time. However, oh. it was apparently not immune to the effects of conventional weaponry. Oh man! Having dissipated before leaving Dude, behind this object. Dude, shut up! Object. Yes, Commander. You talk a lot. Holy crap! There's so much talking in this game. <laughs> this killed my frame rate, though. On the genetic Holy cow! From the advent black site. Imply we may have only scratched the surface of the alien's infrastructure oh. to this avatar project. We were fortunate to recover the genetic sample when we did. Otherwise, our path may have very well ended here. Okay. Uh, we're going to see if we can if we can fix that. Mark the location Shen pulled from the Codex, Commander. It's a remote region, out in the woods, away from any populated areas. We'll need to contact the local resistance forces if we want to get a closer look. This is the coordinates. It looks like we've got our work cut out for us, Commander. Nope, not yet. I want to finish what I'm doing. 
for anything else. Okay. Let's go make contact with Mexico. Course for the Mexican Regional Tract. to establish local regional contact. Okay. Let's, uh... Okay. Sure. I don't know. We'll, uh... We'll see if our frame rate is still killed elsewhere. And if so, we'll pause the video, patch this all together, and then figure it out from there. But we should have everybody healed by now, I believe. Uh, advanced explosives. Interesting. All right, so frame rate. Still messed up. Still seems messed up. Proving ground. That was probably a proving ground. Millions of innocent lives unknowingly walking right into the alien's trap. We should have realized sooner. Oh, advanced explosives. Their message has always been out of Mars, and they've certainly got a lot more incentives to offer in the city centers than we do out here. Either way, we can't let this sound good, Commander. I'll let you know as soon as the project is ready for deployment. New objective added. Skulljack on a codex. Ugh. Commander, I've updated our current objectives based on the most recent findings. Okay, well, we broke the shadow chamber. <laughs> what is going on? Why is. Okay, hitting escape worked. Like, I don't know where all the buttons went, but yes. Alright, so now we've made contact here. Long live the resistance. New regional contacts located. Let's fly up there and make contact with them. Yeah, we're gonna make contact with them last. to establish local regional contact. Oh. Advent Olipuela. Oh, yeah, I can't speak. 230 supplies. Scientist. I think that looks good. Colonel Grenadier. Also looks good. There's two blocks of progress, though. Well, we got four. And I have a feeling these other missions I'm about to go on are about to take it down some as well. So that's the question. I, sh I have plenty of supplies at this point. Supplies are not really an issue. I think the Grenadier is actually probably the best one. But yeah, since we're not going on that last mission, that black site yet, we're gonna go over here and do this. So we're gonna, we, uh. aren't going to be happy if we don't put the Skulljack to good use. We should have one of our soldiers equipped plasma grenades. Okay, that's you can tell my frame rate is crap, so we're gonna we're gonna back out real quick here. When we uh I don't know, I don't need to tell you guys what's going on. I'm gonna back out and then when I come back, uh I'll stitch it together, so Alright everybody, sorry about that. Uh frame rate seems to be running fine. I went ahead and did loadout for everyone. 
Uh, noticeable things is I'm using a Shredder gun for uh, Neg Primer, and for Gaven is our healer. Uh, Amy Hennig has the ghost suit on, and uh, as well as everything else. Uh, one interesting thing did happen when I went to pick to change Sid Meier's name here to Pirate. Uh, it actually gave me the option of importing an XCOM hero. Or rather, it started to do it without like my input and uh, said it would disable achievements. I don't know, it was really weird. But uh, apparently they have, they have certain people already developed uh, in their creator that it wanted to import. And uh, interestingly enough, it looked almost identical to him, except he had some extra moles on his face. I don't know. It's kind of weird. I need to look up what all that was about. XCOM Heroes. Again, that's not what that word means, but we'll go with it. For that phrase. A hacker working for the resistance installed a data tap along the advent network in this area. And the data they're retrieving is critical to the aliens' latest operation. Recon suggests the aliens are already moving to destroy the device. That data is too valuable to lose, so we're moving in to secure the area. Eliminate all hostile contacts and protect that gear. So it's basically okay, I'm looking sorry, I'm looking it up on my phone while that was reading. Uh, so it basically, oh, really, they were an XCOM enemy unknown as well. S Damn it, the images, Sid Meier, Ken Levine, Otto Xander, really? At Something Awful Let's Player, Joe Kelly, comic book artist, Chris Clue, who's of course a uh, NFL punter that uh, I used to have a lot more respect for, but now I don't so much anymore. There's some, there's, this is interesting. So these are the original, or not the original, these are, uh, I don't know, there's a couple more. William Carter, lead character of Bureau. Well, I don't know. Sorry, uh, that's a little bit of an aside, but I thought that was, I thought that was interesting. That uh, apparently you can do that. I didn't realize you could ever do that in the enemy with it. Forces are already moving to destroy the data tap installed nearby. We need to lock down the area and secure the device at all costs. It's really kind of sad that clip. I don't know. I, I don't hate Chris Clue or anything like that. Don't get me wrong. It just seems like such a weird choice. Uh, because who the fuck is Chris Clue? Like, I realize he's popular in some places, but. Does your average person actually really care at all about Chris Clue? Is the game benefit in any way by having him in it? Copy that. I don't know. I don't know. It's a weird choice. But uh I don't know. But it's cool, it's cool that they did that. We'll leave it there. It is cool that they they uh incorporated somebody like that. Hey, it's a codec. Commander. Okay. That codex provides the ideal opportunity to infiltrate the advent network. We will need to well, move in with the skulljack to initiate the process. Like it's just that simple. interesting. Why does that leave me out of cover? Rolling. 
Oh damn it! I thought I had you, or me, or whatever selected. I'm on the move. Well, they're moving away from us. Oh, we do have to get out there quickly. Keep them from blowing that thing up. Say, Emmy Hennig. Well. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Can I get out over here somewhere to do some good? Ruskles, I can put you back here. It's not what I wanted to do, but... Oh, damn! You had line of sight over there. Who knew? Got it. Moving. Okay, well... I can't really get you. You have line of sight from here, too. Okay. Let's open this door. On the prize. Not you. You. Not you. You. Not you. All right, let's try to skulljack. They spotted us. Right, but we're already moving. This might sting a little. Oh, okay. Hello. <laughs> we have like no chance of either one of these happening. Have a really low tech score. Oh man! So that should kill the codex, right? And then he's hi. <laughs> He'll trigger all our Overwatches. I should know why this was already on fire before I even started here. What the fuck? They've got eyes on me. Commander, I believe we are seeing something entirely new. An alien species that has so far managed to elude capture or observation by resistance forces. I strongly Avatar. So that was the avatar. Okay, well. The good news is we managed to put an end to that really quickly. Alright, I'll go. Like that people are just climbing this. Out. Sid Meier has all kinds of abilities. Okay, I'll go. Gavin, we might as well move you. It. 
far up as we can get. Ruskulls, I want you up on the roof. Got it. Hopefully that's the last we'll see of the Avatar. And it won't like somehow make an appearance. Because if I killed it, you know, during its introduction, then that's great. Oh. Okay, that's not where I meant to click, but I guess it works. It's clear. I guess that'll be okay. Objective here. Menace one five. We've got a line on the target. Move to protect that gear at all costs. So yeah, interesting, interesting mission that we managed to uh, On my way. trigger that. I kind of think, based on what I know of the game, I kind of think that might be the, uh, to let's call it the ultimate enemy. Like, I'm sure there's something else that's that's uh, stronger, but, uh, out. Get some. that might be I'm the last regular the enemy we'll see. Quiet. Do you hear something? I don't know a ton about the game, though, so I could be completely mistaken on that. Hello. It's a good thing we have, uh... I don't know what you're pointing at. <laughs> I've got something. Adjusting aim! Let's, uh, try to go cut him down. So that might have been all the enemy. It's stone. That is not all the enemies. Double time. Advent troops here. Oh. Ah, oh, damn it, a gatekeeper. This, this does not give in the fuck. Demolition, what is the blaster bomb? It's killing time. Does that hit that guy in the back? Oh, we can't do that anyways. Ha! That'll destroy our own thing. Well... Target still up. Crap. Well, if I thought I was gonna get through this... Void Rift... 
Oh, that's just like single file. I'm with you. We can do domination on that, huh? Fascinating. Damn, that actually got lower. I'm shooting at a different enemy this time. Shot failed to connect. Run and dry. Okay, well, the good news is we've taken control of the gatekeeper. So the thing that's really gonna damage us is out of, the, out of it. For right now. And theoretically, they'll try to take it out, so. I might have taking legitimate damage on that. Okay, let's take a look at you. You can run all the way in there. Skull mine. As opposed to Skull Jack. Deploying the jack. <laughs> Camera is so terrible. Oh, seriously? Okay, well, I guess that answers what that does. Oh, hey, thank God we actually. That actually worked. What about you, gatekeeper? Let's move you out here where we can all see ya. Oh, why did that... Oh, what? That removed control from... Weird. It looks like his the trail is coming over here. What are some of his stasis, soul fire, six to eight? Um, it's actually not that good of a deal. It's guaranteed, but it's not guaranteed to kill him. Oh, that's confirmed. Oh my gosh! Are down and the area is that's gonna end that, even though Mission accomplished. we didn't destroy the gatekeeper. <laughs> that's funny. Do we get anything for capturing it? That's funny, I thought I was going to have to take it out. But I guess not. Okay, so we got... Uh... I don't know, this moved furthest status stat is really weird. Because it's like, does that... Does that one really matter at all? Moved furthest? Like... I don't know.
But yeah, so we got some, uh, we got some good kills off of that. I think I got injured, but even then, I think it was just lightly wounded. You got all kinds of scars, lady, and I th I'm trying to remember. I'll have to go back and look at the earlier videos and see if you've always had those. Or if the game actually scars you over time. It might not be the case for uh, custom characters, because I don't look that scarred. Although, no, I do kind of see there was like a scar or something on his... the left side of his face. And, uh, I've been injured a lot. I think most other people have gotten injured once or twice, but not, not you, and I don't think you either. Ruskles has gotten injured a couple times for sure, but not dramatic. But we should all be good except for me. Our troops are oh, making it easy out there. Lightly wounded. All thanks to you. Like sprained my ankle. Oh. Oh. Ruskell's has by far been on the most missions. That's what a good sniper will do for you. Alright, and then we have Gaben as a medic. Commander, although I firmly believe. The specimen we have recovered is crucial to the alien's efforts. We currently do not have the means of properly studying. New objective added. You and your crew have dealt another serious blow to the alien's efforts today, Commander. And Fisher. Work. I don't think she actually looks like that. I think that's a glitch. So, in Fisher. Salvo, saturation fire. So we'll just go all the way down demo expert. She beat King. <laughs> Fisher. Alright. So yeah, I got I got wounded on that. Uh just lightly wounded, I'll be out three days. That's no biggie. Um, okay. I had fully expected to find that the aliens were conducting questionable experiments involving human captives at the black site we raided with the help of local resistance operatives. What we did find was something more reprehensible than I could have possibly imagined. A facility solely dedicated to the rendering and refinement of human genetic material on an industrial scale. The aliens have crossed the boundaries of known science. Consequences be damned. So we have to we have to do an autopsy on him as our last thing. It looks like uh, codex brain coordinates, black site vial coordinates. Uh, well, we still got time to run things down a little bit more. That cost the Avatar project this some hits. This creature your troops encountered may be a critical piece of the Avatar project, Commander. Your efforts are to be oh. commended. It's called an Avatar. Why would I ever want rookies at this stage in the game? Setting course for the Western Let's go US make contact. Racing. Guys, I'm domination. Okay. Sid Meier's got another day in there. See? I 
I want to take a look at Sid Meier real quick. Because if we look at him... Uh, if we look at his abilities specifically... See, look at this crap here. Holy... He's almost completely decked out. He's the most capable of any of our soldiers, and he's been in one mission and got one kill. Although he did take over the gatekeeper. That was pretty awesome. That's really insane that they level up that way. And they level up so much. That makes that a big thing to get to get in on as quickly as possible. Hey guys. More connections. Okay, so now there should be only one last place to go. Should be New Australia and then Eastern US. Sorry, I got one more, one last one before the well before the last one. Um, <laughs> so we're gonna try to get this done, uh, and then we'll go do uh, the Black Site Vile coordinate. Attempting to establish local regional contact. Yay! I'm all better. Yeah, I'm okay. Advanced explosives, EMP bomb, oof. Smoke bomb. Skulljack, war suit, wrath suit. We never did make a spider suit. But I kind of wonder if it's not pointless after we already have the Wraith suit. I guess let's build one and find out. I hope that takes our last loom core, apparently. Yeah, I guess we'll find out. This might be his last upgrade. Okay. Coming through clear. Yeah, I don't care about picking up rookies so much. It's almost worthwhile to go through and just start building radio beacons everywhere. Uh to make sure that we get all these bonuses, although most of them, most of them aren't going to make a difference at this point in the game. GTS tactic costs reduced by 50. See, and that would have been really good to have really early on. But I don't know. Um, I think this is our best bet. Uh, Especially now that we've got everybody maxed out to the uh, the best that they can be. You know, you're not Moses. You're gonna have to cross the Red Sea. But with that in mind... Let's go ahead and remove everybody for now. We'll make all armor available, we'll make all utility items available. We will start with Notch, because we know we want Notch. We also know we want Ruskulls. We know we want me, even though I'm only a major. Shut up, I'm trying! Uh, we'll take Team Tilt Killer Von Traderson. He's a, he's a good guy, he hasn't done us wrong yet. We'll take Sid Meier. And then... The 
question is, do we take another colonel? Uh, we are missing an assassin if we do this. Uh, we do not have an assassin. We have two specialists. That's all we have. That's all we're missing. Um, so with that in mind, if we were to do a ranger, we would have uh, this character who we will name. I don't have a problem naming individual characters. Uh, or we can go down to Amy Hennig or Oliver Wood and give him a name. They're both lieutenants, so if I was going to do that, I'd go with Amy Hennig. I mean, here's the thing, is that's still pretty far away. But it's one character that's not a colonel. Just one character that's not a colonel. Colonel, colonel, well, major, colonel, and magus, which is basically colonel. Although he hasn't really been on all that many missions. How does that work out for him? Mobility, I mean, he has a bunch of psi, he has really low hack. Will of 100, aim of 75. If we compare that... Uh, you know, if we compare that... Yeah, sure, let's compare it to you. Aim of 70... Uh, uh, not much different. Not much different. Definitely different, but not much. Um, so I think that's actually going to be where we go. Uh, that looks good. I mean, we'll have... I still need to level up. And Amy Hennig over here uh, still has plenty of leveling up to do. But it actually only calls this mission difficult and not very difficult. Even though it said there were 13 enemies. I don't want to uh, I don't want to run the risk, so I'm gonna keep all of my colonels in. This is gonna I, I feel good about this squad. So alright, I'm gonna equip them off camera. Uh, when we come back, it'll be, uh, it won't be tonight. It might be tomorrow, but it might not. We'll have to see. Uh, but either way, I want to thank you all for watching. Uh, I do want to apologize once more for taking, I think I took like three days off, uh, without any new videos whatsoever on my channel. Um, there's a reason for that with the Prince of Persia series. Uh... But I don't want to go into it here. I'll go into it on that video series when I make that comeback. Uh, which should be, you know, next week probably. Like I said, some bad, some, some stuff happens. And, uh, yeah. But alright. Uh, I think we're getting close to the end here. Uh, we obviously have at least two or three more missions left to do, and then probably a final mission after that. And, uh, you know, whatever comes up just in the rotation. But uh, we might not have much longer left, so I want to thank you all for watching, and I will hope to see you on the next video.